in front of the tin machine of Andy Welch. Those two cars didn't have heavy contact, but did have a bunch of wild ride. Oh, oh my goodness. I can't believe I am saying this. But the 48 machine just hit the tractor. I looked up, and the 48 machine just didn't want to turn and it hit the tractor. You can see why the car didn't want to turn. Well, the 48 machine of Alex Odishu said, if I'm going to lose my suspension, so is the tractor. That car carried a heck of a lot of momentum off that corner. And I also want to say thanks to all of you folks coming from Merced, your Merced drivers. I imagine Odish is trying to figure out how bad is it? Can I continue? Is the tractor going to come after me? There's all sorts of questions now. Because of all these issues with Tim Cecil pulling it off the track, and this car potentially unable to continue, which I don't know how it would. Odish, you uh, never say die. Well, unless you're the right front, then it, it it said that. Now, the people in the pit area need to keep an eye out for this tire. It is on its way to hit something right now. And I believe it's curved back away from anybody in the, the pits. So, Odishu just had, I believe, the two most exciting turns of the entire event on the same lap. My goodness. Don't mess with that 48 machine. But I, you know what? I am someone who gives credit for trying, and the 48 machine was not ready to quit. So credit to an issue for at least saying, you know what? This is my only opportunity to make it in. This car was third at the time of caution.